Let's discuss Laplace's equation in polar coordinates. Hello everyone. First, when we work with circular domains, it's more convenient to write the Laplace equation, Laplacian of u equals zero, in polar coordinates r theta as the second partial derivative of u with respect to r plus one over r times the partial derivative of u with respect to r plus one over r squared times the partial derivative of u with respect to theta equals zero. Here, u is a function of r and theta, and the link between polar and Cartesian coordinates is x equals r cos theta and y equals r sine theta. To solve this equation, we can use the separation of variables as before, so u equals capital R of R times capital F of theta, and obtain two equations. First, the second derivative of F of theta plus k times f of theta equals zero, and r squared times r double dash plus r times r dash minus k times r equals zero. We need to have the same solution for theta equals zero and theta equals two pi, which means that f needs to be periodic with a period two pi, so we need k to be zero or a positive integer. Solving both equations, for the second one try r equals r to the m, we obtain the general solution u of r to theta is equal to the sum over all m of r to the m times a sub n cos m theta plus b sub n sine m theta plus r to the minus m times c sub n cos m theta plus d sub n sine m theta plus e theta plus f log r plus g where a sub n b sub m c sub n d sub n e f g are constants and m is an integer. Because of the periodicity of theta, we should usually ask that e equals zero. Also, a regularity of solution at i equals zero, we impose f equals zero. As ever, thank you for watching.